Kingstar. Losing Kingstar. is never Kingstar. an option. Kingstar. No excuses. Kingstar. We Kingstar. will Kingstar. succeed. Kingstar. Don't stop shouting. Motivation. Don't stop Illumination. Don't stop shouting. Liberation. Don't stop Kingstar. acceleration. Kingstar. Oh, one of those loud trucks as soon as I try to record. Hello, it's Monday, which is one of the most hated days of the week for a lot of people. <laughs> they feel sluggish about Mondays, and I've been there. Uh, Sunday night, you feel like, oh gosh, we have to do this all over again. Didn't see any results from last week, but our word for today is persistent or persistent C. Um, R. Kelly has a song, I Believe I Can Fly. And one of the lines in the song is, if I can see it, then I can be it. If I can see it, then I can be it. I think that's right, right? If I can see it, I can be it. If I can see it, I can do it. But what happens when you can't see it? I want to deal with that just for a few minutes. When you have a goal in mind, or anything, anything, anything that you want to do, you may not know exactly where you're going to end up. You just know that, hey, I'm going to hit this really hard. I'm looking to hit this target, but I don't really know exactly what will become of all of this effort I'm giving. I have this on paper. I have on paper. This is where I'm hoping to get. But according to what's going on right now, it doesn't look like that's going to happen. I don't see the results. I didn't see any results last week. Heck, the last six months, I haven't seen any money. I haven't seen any increase. It seems like my fan base is dying out. I don't, I don't see any support. I don't see any, any results. If you're feeling like that, I am here to tell you today, keep moving. If you are alone, keep moving. If you feel like you don't have any support, keep moving. Even if you don't feel like getting out of bed, you have to be your own coach. You have to be your own cheerleader because I'm telling you, you may not always see it. It's a great thing. It's a bonus if you do. If you can always see your way through, but for me, sometimes I feel like I'm literally walking in darkness. Hey, that's my truth. Yes, I know who I am. I, I live, uh, I would say I live, I'm a very high-spirited person. I, I know that I'm, I'm self-motivating. Yet sometimes I feel like I'm walking in darkness. Like I literally don't know the next move. Like I'm doing according to what my calendar tells me to do, according to what my memo tells me to do. I'm following all of that. But sometimes I feel like I'm walking in darkness. And when you feel that way, you don't sit down. You don't stand against the wall. If there is even a wall in there, you don't start fighting all of your support. The ones who are trying to rescue you and trying to assist you when you're walking in the valley or walking through darkness. You keep moving. You don't give up. Because there is light at the end of the tunnel. Just because you don't see it, it doesn't mean that it's not there. Think about fog. We get alerts on our phones telling us about the fog. It's a severe fog. Turn on your headlights and be very careful. Drive more slow so that you can, you know, be aware, more cautious of what's going on around you. Because in heavy fog, it could be something 8 to 12 feet ahead of you and if you're going 70 80 miles per hour you may say well hey there's nothing there but you may run into in the back with someone if they don't have their lights on or even if they do have their lights on if the fog is that heavy you may not see it so i just want to encourage you today to maybe you may have to slow down and walk a little bit slower if you're running and just slow down and move steady because steady is so much better than rushing take your time Look, you have your own timeline. Don't measure your life against others. And just know that in time, you are going to get exactly where you need to be. As long as you stay focused, even if you're walking in darkness, hey, stay focused as best you can. Stay encouraged. Cheer your own self on. Be your own coach because in certain moments in your life, it's going, it's going to get silent. There may even be times where God is not speaking because he's already given you direction. And until you get to the next, um, the next level or until you cross over into the next lane, he doesn't give you any other, uh, tips. So when you're walking in a season like that and it's quiet and you don't know where, what to do and where to turn, my advice to you is to stay persistent. Do what you know to do. Even if that's just to 
stand and wait for a moment and get yourself together and then begin to walk again. Hey, whatever it takes for you to get to where you need to get, do that. But by all means, do not stop. Keep moving. Stay persistent. Happy Monday. Get up and get moving. Move it Monday. Go do what you got to do to be great.